Hey there, seekers of style, knowledge, and all that good stuff. Joe here from Style by Joe with some health and wellness tips from not such an average Joe, which of course is the Joe in front of you right now. So let's talk about your health. How healthy have you been during this whole COVID-19 thing? Have you been taking proper care of yourself? Are you watching out for the only you you're ever going to have? Well, today I'm going to go over six different things to help you make a little bit more of a healthier lifestyle change. And number one is stop worrying just about muscle. Yes, that muscular physique is great. It's amazing. Guys, girls, it, it's great to have that build. But I'll tell you what, if you're not doing cardio and stretching as well as that mus building that muscle, you're not really doing the best job for your body. The older I get, the more that I realize I need to stretch. I'm not as limber as what I used to be. And actually, I have started doing yoga in the morning and it's made a huge amount of difference. I try and get my cardio in every day. I'm trying to be physically more well-rounded. Number two is you need to eat a well-balanced diet. Now, obviously, if you're lactose intolerant, you're taking care of that. If you can't handle the gluten, you're taking care of that. But I am a firm believer that if you don't have those health conditions, you should try and get every food group that you can, your fruits, your vegetables, your dairy. While we're on that, how about eating less processed food? I know, it's crazy, it's so simple, it's right in front of you. You can just grab that and go. But if you've been in lockdown during COVID-19, haven't you learned how to cook yet? Haven't you learned how to prepare that meal that you've always wanted? COVID, we've had time. You can really learn how to make food for yourself instead of relaying on those processed things. And while we're talking about that, it's a little bit more expensive, but that free range beef, those free range chickens, I find them just to be tastier cuts of meat. They're living the way they were intended to be living. And red meat, have you cut down on your consumption of it? I know I have. I know I'm trying to eat more plant-based and I feel better. I notice weight come off because of it. Number three, leading right into that. I believe taking vitamins is an important step in being healthier. Especially if you're, <coughs> excuse me. If you're not taking, if you're not consuming dairy products, you probably need some calcium in there. You're not eating red meats. You should probably figure out some sort of iron in there. I know come the winter time, I bulk up on my vitamin C and my zinc. Do some research. Find out what you need to be a little bit more healthier. Number four, used to be a big problem for me, getting enough sleep. The average person needs a solid eight hours. Some fall a little bit more, some fall a little bit less, but shoot for that eight. And I'll tell you what, if you can make that room cooler and darker, you're going to get a better night's sleep. Number five, I want you to try drinking at least, at least a gallon of water a day. I know it. people think that the more water you drink, the more water weight you're going to retain, but it's just the opposite. The more water you drink, the more water your body fleshes out. Try season, or seasoning. Try flavoring that with a little bit of lemon. It tastes a little bit better, plus it's going to flush a little bit more. And number six, and here is probably the biggest one. Try to exercise that forgiveness muscle. Yeah. The more you can forgive yourself 
And the more you can forgive others, the healthier mentally you're going to be. And you might need to talk to somebody. You might need to talk to a therapist. It might take some really uncomfortable steps to exercise that forgiveness muscle, but you're gonna feel so much better. You literally will feel baggage and weights drop off. Hey folks, this has been Joe from Style by Joe with some health and wellness tips from Not Such an Average Joe, which of course is the Joe in front of you right now. I have all my social media listed below. It would be great if you could follow me on all my platforms. As always, give me a thumbs up, drop me a comment, helps me to know what you're looking for, also helps YouTube follow me. Share these videos with your friends and family because they deserve to be just as stylish and knowledgeable as you are. And if you really enjoyed this video, you can always go to my Patreon page and uh, donate, contribute a little bit to help me produce some more videos. Folks, stay stylish. Take these simple steps simple six steps to be a little bit more healthier, and I'll talk to you soon.